the internet is what I refer to as this noisy digital ocean. There's a lot of noise being created. There's a lot of creators jumping on every single day. There's different demographics, different age groups. So you have to really um, take a step back and first assess like whether you're a personal brand or a corporate brand, what do you really want to be known for? So when people think of your brand, what's the first thing that, that you want them to think? Is it a product? Is it a service? Is it a person? Um, is it a mission? Is it a goal? Is it culture? Like that's first and foremost, very important. The second is before you really go, you know, crazy tweeting or posting or creating a marketing plan, you really need to take some time to do some due diligence on what others in your space are doing. Right. Um, if you want to be a guru, a marketing guru, what are the marketing gurus doing really well that you can maybe model, but put on your own flavor, you know, or your own style. Uh, the the point I'm trying to make here is that it takes time to build anything, right? It takes, it takes a long time to build a brand. It takes time to become great. You know, I've been doing social media marketing since 2008, um, 13 years now. I started when I was 25, I'm 37, you know, actually now 12 years, almost 13. Um, but the point I'm trying to make, man, is that we're also working in a space that's always evolving. It's constantly changing. None of us own the IP to any of these platforms. So we're really at the mercy of these platforms, which dictate our own growth and our own success. Uh, so that's why I said before, man, consistency and learning, understanding, trial and error, seeing what works, seeing what doesn't, learn from both, um, and, and continuously moving forward. Like that's the one thing I'll say about social media marketing and being successful in the space. You always got to be moving forward. You can't stay stagnant. You can't move backwards. You got to just keep moving forward. And that's what dictates your success. It's it's speed and efficiency. Speed and efficiency. That's uh those are those are two areas that I'm narrowing my message more and more. And I'm focusing on those two areas being on on marketing productivity slash time management and and good habits or good marketing habits, trying to narrow down or not trying to, it's just a little bit moving towards that, that, um, that area, instead of just talking about tactics or something, something on those, that nature. 